Sunday. It is a really beautiful day today. It is a very grey November day but I think a cloudy sky can be just as beautiful as blue skies in summer at least in my opinion. I'm not really a huge fan of summertime anyways. So yeah and I just came back from my walk. It's actually actually noon already <laughs> because the thing is I went out with my new shoes and they hurt my feet so bad. <laughs> I mean, I kind of expected it because every new pair of shoes does that to my feet. I'm just really sensitive, apparently. And so I went back home, put on some other shoes and went out a second time. <laughs> so it's noon already, but, I, you know, it doesn't really matter. And the walk was so beautiful. I really love going on these Sunday morning walks. I've been doing this for, well, almost two years now, you know. Um, before, I think I started just... A tiny bit before the pandemic started and it's been so great really just going out every single week at least once you know for one to two hours and it really put me back in this autumn sort of vibes and mood which is nice because lately I've been very into the wintry Christmassy mood already kind of and yeah so today what I'm planning on doing is just relax and read and probably paint a little bit my sketchbook because I've been really bad this month with painting and drawing regularly unfortunately so I'm just gonna have a very chill day and take you guys along. I also found two very beautiful leaves during my walk. Colours, love it. And also very cute, there was a tree with small apples. Look at those. So tiny, but very cute. I think I'm going to put them on the piano.
20 past five and I haven't read as much as I'd wanted to. I read 20 pages I think which is not too much but um it's a great book. I just read the passage where it is actually winter and freezing cold so it doesn't match the autumn mood I got when I went on my walk today at all but that's just fine. <laughs> but you know I think it's gonna take me so long this book has about like 600 and 16 pages something like that anyway it doesn't matter you know as soon as I get it finished before the end of November would be nice because then I want to read more sort of wintry and Christmassy sort of books to get me in the mood um and yeah I've also you now I took a nap I watched a bit of YouTube I watched um Christy Christy Ann Jones new video I really like that and um yeah, well, played a bit of piano, you've seen all of this. Uh, unfortunately, I don't really have the time to practice more, all the new pieces. But I just play my favourites over and over and over again. And now I think I'm going to do a bit of um, painting and drawing in my sketchbook. I haven't done this in a couple of days, so... I think I'm gonna go with gouache and cut pencils again. Um, it's been pretty much to me that I've used in the last couple of weeks, the last month probably. And I think I'm going to do very sort of colourful autumn inspired thread using, you know, these leaves and things as inspiration and also those two very cute apples that I found today. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to do that. I'm also going to listen to Taylor Swift. It is Red Season. Lovely. And uh, yeah, going to enjoy some drawing time finally. This week been so busy, haven't done any drawing or painting.
I'm done with my drawing. It's just a very quick sort of autumnal spread. Can you see that? Yeah, I don't know if it is. The sketchbook is red too. It's very red themed today. So I really just did a couple of leaves and all of those that I found doing my last walks outside and I quite like it, you know, it's just very sort of illustration kind of style that I'm trying to develop and yeah, I think I'm going to go have something to eat now and then just relax for the rest of the night.